hey guys welcome back to a new vlog if you're new welcome if you're returning thank you so much for coming back so i'm guessing this is vlogmas three we're not gonna say day three or day whatever we're just gonna say whatever number of vlogmas video this is so i'm guessing this is vlogmas three um and it's actually the first of december so i'm so excited it's my birthday month officially countdown before i turn 28 it is so crazy like literally i still feel like i'm 21 you could tell me that i'm still 21 and i would believe you i mean look at this face but yeah um i've obviously showered i'm all dressed been working i just have a campaign that i need to post right now and it's for arc and obviously in the last video i did tell you guys that i was going to unbox the stuff to show you guys what i got there's like a fragrance in there that i'm loving i actually don't know why when i was um searching for a perfume to buy last was it this year when i got the tom ford i don't know why i didn't go look at the bulgari perfumes because if you guys didn't know when i was i think about 13 i had like a weekend job and i worked at a perfume store so my sister and i worked at the perfume store my sister worked there first so yeah as i was saying before i ran out of space my sister actually worked there first and then obviously me being me i also wanted to work and she managed to get me a job i obviously wasn't getting paid as much as she was but guys it was still a lot i think i used to get paid about 100 rand a day so i'd make like 200 in a weekend and um i would work over the holidays as well so that was quite a lot like if i worked for a week i managed to make like 600 rand and back in those days guys when i was 13 600 rand was a lot and where did all my money go mr price because at that time that's all we knew mr price so yeah um i used to work at a perfume store and i remember at the time like the bulgari perfumes were very popular um so i think i got i think it's more jasmine-y like i told you guys i think i really like jasmine perfumes because my tom ford is a jasmine perfume um so yeah i will show you guys what i got in the box but i just want to quickly post because i'm supposed to post right now um but yeah let's quickly post and then i'll show you guys the reel on it's actually a story today and then the reel on the third so i'll show you guys the stories just give me one second Hey guys so i'm currently off to the car wash because my car is like very dirty um and i need to go to the office tomorrow it looks so bad um so yeah i've just carried my laptop with me i'm actually taking this as my lunch break but i just decided i might as well just work while i'm there because i'm gonna be bored um so yeah i'm gonna unbox a couple of things that i received when i come back with you guys and then we're just gonna quickly pass through builders to get something for the umbrella and then we are definitely moving it upstairs today i'm already out of breath um i think i should just carry a bottle of water i've carried a jacket in case i get cold but let us get going because that car looks crazy i'll show you guys like my rims you can't even see the color all you see is like dust i'll show you guys like what it looks like when we get downstairs so i'm just gonna take this down to my storage and place it in there downstairs just so that it's taking up space in my house Thank you. 
So this is the disaster that is within. Why is the light not going on? But the chairs are in here. More boxes. So, yeah. so it's gone on. So I just have like my suitcases. I have my bright stand that I need to assemble. Yeah. And I see there's some spider webs. This is how cute to go. Please look at how dirty. Well, you can't really see on here, but it's very dirty. So I'm at the car wash now. I'm just gonna sit inside whilst they wash. And then I'll obviously go park there and then when they clean inside, I'll sit outside. It was a little dodgy. I've never been to this car wash before. I've obviously had to change like the car wash I used to use, which I loved because they knew how to like make sure that your car is super clean. So I'm giving this one a try because the one I tried, yo guys, I don't wash my car that often. The one I tried, this is why I need a boyfriend who's gonna come weekly and take my car to the car wash. The one uh, car wash I tried, they put some greasy oil thing on my leather seat. And I was just like, why are you putting oil on my seat? Guys, is this flu eating me up or what? I feel like I look very, like, diafa. But I look very sick. Um, so yeah, um, I just decided I'm not going back to that car wash because... I don't want some greasy stuff in my car like I even had to wipe down with like a cloth I had to bring like um, a, a cloth and a bucket with plain water and like try wipe down the car because it was just that oily and I was just like why would you do that so yeah hopefully this one is like proper and I'm gonna keep an eye on them I'm gonna tell them please don't apply anything on the interior of the car um, because it's like some areas are still kind of a little bit oily but i guess it's starting to wear off but yeah like especially the back i think because no one hardly sits there so yeah just thought i would update you guys that i'm here and hopefully it doesn't take too long because i want to pass by boulders before my lunch break is over hey guys so just sitting waiting outside now got myself water started to get room temperature they didn't have a big one in room temperature and i didn't want to get a cold one so i got this and i've been craving these i haven't eaten lunch but i just thought i could get myself a bag because i've been craving them and i always forget to get them when i go grocery shopping so yeah i'm just gonna wait while they clean the inside and then Chelsea. Then we'll pass by boulders and then go home. clean again if i actually showed you guys what this looked like before you would have loved it so i'm here and i've been told to go to outdoor i don't know where outdoor is but let's try find it i don't know whether he meant outside if it's here also shouldn't somebody be helping me i don't see birds okay let me rather just go ask for help because I can't see what I'm looking for Let's just go ask for help when I see turf like my chairs are similar to that but not this color and I think of getting I'm thinking of getting turf it'd be so nice like content up there because all you have to do is I think wash it so you just pour like water on it i don't know maybe you guys can comment down below i want a table like this but like a longer one so like one definitely with holes and this type of material maybe i can ask if they have a bigger one then we'll see
hey guys so it's evening time now um i know i didn't vlog much when i got back i just went like straight into working i did go to builders to look for the cement thing and they didn't have it at the builders that's close to me so i'm gonna have to go look for it somewhere else but i just wanted to show you guys this is the other um, gown that i said i had purchased together with the previous one i think i prefer the other one it's so much more softer so if they have that other one in another color i think i'll buy it um this one just feels a little too harsh like it's not a soft silk material so um yeah i don't really really like it. it's not as comfortable as that other one that other one just sits on you so yeah um i did get like quite a few dms people asking me like what i applied to my hair and stuff like that so i just wanted to come show you guys for some of you guys that are new so usually after i've relaxed my hair like the first week i will apply this strength fusion post chemical treatment it's an intense nighttime treatment so it's this mizani over here and they do sell it at the salon that i go do my hair at so i apply this for the first week every night and then i go for the strength fusion treatment which i'm gonna go do on saturday now with this when it starts to build up your scalp will itch i know when i arrive obi's actually gonna ask me how my scalp has been and obviously with like product buildup your scalp tends to itch um and then i use this during the day which is the mizani coconut souffle it's a mineral oil free um moisturizing cream so this is what it looks like i also purchased it there i know you can also purchase this i think off disc but it's only online and then for my hairline i've been using this miracle length drops um hairline and root stimulator so i've put like on my hairline and i just like put a bit on my scalp um but yeah that's about it that i usually put on my hair and then i have the a miracle milk spray that i usually use as a heat protector and a leave-in conditioner after i've done my hair and i deep condition every week like i mentioned um so yeah um in the last vlog i know i mentioned that i got myself a steam pod it didn't take so long to arrive so i finally purchased my own um i was hoping it would still be on sale by the time i actually published this vlog but i see it's gone back to its normal price so this actually retails for five thousand I think 300 but I got it for 2.5 um, and I got it on Sunday so just before the Black Friday sales uh, finished so yeah this product is the bomb.com so I'm so happy I finally got myself one and I can't wait to use it so yeah I think you want to see what plug this one comes with okay yeah at least this one is a south african plug because tandy's one she got before i think they were available to purchase in south africa so she's got the american plug and she often has to use an adapter i'm glad this is a south african plug and then if you are a lydia millen diehard fan like you've been following her since forever you would know that her vlogs i think from 20 2016 2017 Lydia Millen used to rave about Zaflora. Like, if you followed her, every single vlog she'd talk about Zaflora. So, I noticed that um, Take A Lot is now selling it. So, I decided to try it out. And I love anything that smells linen fresh. Um, so, anything with a linen scent, I love. So, I decided to go for the linen fresh scent. So, this is what it looks like. And what it basically is, is that it's a concentrated multi-purpose disinfectant. So, you can basically use it for anything. You can use it um, when cleaning. You can put it, like, in a spritz bottle. You can use it to mop your floors. You can um, throw, like, a cap into your um, sink. And that will help. Oh, there's a mosquito. That will help with like the smell. You can use it for your toilet. And it's got a 24 hour fragrance. And it says kills 99% uh, viruses and bacteria and eliminates odor. So, yeah, I got myself the linen fish. And this is how big it is. This is like 240, I think. And you can also put like a cap size, I think, into your laundry. And that will help. So, I got that. The way it's so strong i haven't even opened it and already like it's stuck on my hands and it, i did that yesterday and when i was eating i could taste it 
But the last thing I'm going to unbox with you guys, I know I did say, is the package that I got from ARC. Um, by the time you guys are watching this, the vlog will have gone up. So the first thing we got is this from Lelieve. And this is a skincare brand by Amanda Dupont. So we got the hydrating mist. That looks nice. Let's just open them quickly and show you guys. So we got the hydrating mist. Love, love the packaging. Love the simplicity as well. Um, and then I got the creme de la creme. I'm guessing this is like a day cream. It says light moisturizer. Okay. Also love the fact that they come in different colors. So that's what it looks like. And then I got the jelly cleanser. I wonder what color this is. Okay, this is like a white jelly cleanser. And then I got the vitamin C turmeric and HA brightening serum. Okay. Super, super excited to try this out. I love the colors. I love them. I also love like the writing everything is just so nice and simple so that was the first thing that came in my gift box and then the perfume i was telling you guys about is this bulgari omnia amethyst i think it's an eau de toilette and this is a 65 mil um i'm not too sure what notes this has um but it definitely smells jasmine -y. i don't know i'll google like the notes and put them somewhere here but i love this i think this is my new favorite it's just so fresh and so like smells so summery so i really really love it and then i got this from dr Hauschka. i don't know if that's how you pronounce it it's a balancing day lotion it says balances oily combination skin and soothes blemishes formulated with antilis antilis something like that and then there's like um, a little book in there about all the products that they have. Hmm, it looks very fancy. So they've got like different categories, I'm guessing. So um, let me just quickly see. So they have like for oily skin they have for combination skin so this booklet basically just explains to you everything they have they have eye creams serums regeneration serums um intensive cares they've got skin care for menopause hmm they've also got makeup okay i think i'll take my time to go through this book but i'm super excited to use this it also looks very pretty like all this could make good content for my instagram feed like how beautiful is that that is so beautiful i won't lie that is so pretty and then i received another perfume which is from coach i actually didn't smell this one because on the day i already had perfume on me and i tried the bugari okay mm. this also smells nice and fresh it's a very nice fresh so it's this coach floral eau de parfum and it's a 90 ml hmm and it's got like this cute little flower on it and then it's got the coach logo on it it smells very nice i like it as well it smells very nice and fresh i love it and then i got some products from dermalogica so i got myself not i got myself they gifted me a brightening vitamin c moisturizer i'm not sure but I'm, I'm definitely thinking that the vitamin C products that I'm using are working. As you guys can see, the marks are definitely getting better. I got a circular hydration serum. Um, daily skincare. What is this? Where do you use it? I'm guessing it's more like an eye cream. I'm not too sure. 
um, I got that one and then I got this what is this it's a cleansing gel I'm guessing this is like a mini to try out and then lastly I got this daily milk foliant um, this is a powder exfoliant so it's like a oat it says calming oat based powder exfoliant and then lastly I got these products from Afari so I got like a priming cleanser these are super cute because I feel like you can put these on like your Christmas tree I got an overnight regenerating cream which is this blue one here and then this one is a protecting day cream with SPF 30 and then the last one is a brightening Alexa so super super excited to be trying these super grateful as well for ARC um, for working with both me and my sister and for gifting us these beautiful products I definitely cannot wait to use one of them so yeah I feel like I've rambled for quite a bit I'm gonna get myself into bed I just took a shower and shaved my entire body because I go for my first laser um, treatment tomorrow so yeah i'm looking forward to that i should maybe put the standing because i feel like it's leaking but yeah i've just created a mess that i'm gonna have to clean up tomorrow so i guess i'll pick the vlog up tomorrow i actually thought i was gonna do daily vlogging but i just feel like it's not gonna work because there's not gonna be enough content so this is gonna be a two-day vlog and then i will try start a new one on saturday i do not promise to vlog the whole of saturday because i have other plans I'm not gonna be having my camera with me but anyways um i guess i'll see you guys tomorrow and my plant is actually flourishing i should actually take a picture and send it to the person that, that bought it to say it hasn't died yet but yeah um gonna get myself into bed i hope you guys are enjoying vlogmas so far and yeah see you guys morning guys welcome back today is friday it actually doesn't feel like a friday yesterday felt more like a friday than today does um so yeah i'm just making cereal um because i'm hungry and i've just resorted to cereal because after the whole keto thing i can't really stand eggs and like bacon so I've taken a break of those and I guess this is why some people avoid diets because after the diet you then struggle to eat like your normal regular favorite foods so yeah I've just resorted to having cereal for breakfast and then figuring out what I can have for lunch I should maybe get a scoop for this instead of using my hands because that's not very sanitary um, but yeah, I think I'll think of getting a scoop the next time. I'm out. And then I go and use a different hat. <laughs> After that, I'm such a clown. But I make my cereal with Cremora. I shouldn't be having it because... Can you see like the eczema? But guys, life is too short. So... Yeah, today during my lunch break, I'm going to be heading off for my first laser session so i had to like shave my arms shave my whole entire body basically in anticipation for today so i'm going to be doing face underarms arms legs and bikini um i'm very nervous um because 
I don't like sitting there and just opening my legs in front of someone I don't know so it's gonna be very weird because literally when I used to wax it was like one person that did it um, and I became so comfortable with her that it became so normal so now having to go there and for somebody you don't know it's just gonna be weird so I'll let you guys know how that goes I don't think I'll be able to vlog properly because you have like the um, laser glasses put on you but hopefully it goes well and then I just want to come back and clean up um, I've got a hair appointment tomorrow to wash my hair for my eight day treatment post relaxer treatment um, which I'm doing tomorrow and then I have a little date I don't even know if it's a date it's something chilled so yeah that's what we are doing tomorrow and yeah I'm looking forward to it my flower is actually flourishing guys we've had another little what, what do you call it petal or whatever blossom today I think I want to put it in the sun for a little bit because um, I know they're very sensitive to heat I think so I try to keep it out of the heat as much as possible but I think we're good I think I can now start buying plants because maybe I just have that thing now of wanting to take care of something but yeah um, okay just got an email for my insurance for my car so need to read that and see what is going on but I'm gonna have my breakfast continue working before I have to leave and then I'll catch you guys up either before the laser or after the vibes okay let me update my people about the laser and then i close this vlog off since you want daily vlogs okay we're going to give you daily vlogs i, I can't believe you're planning to say hi hi guys hi cg gang <laughs> it's cg gang yes not tg gang but guys oh i didn't hear you i'm back home hi. now um what was i gonna say um, it was actually not painful like it stings certain places like certain areas that are sensitive like the inner thighs was more stingy but like my arms were okay my legs were okay it was just like a tiny bit of sting and then the other part that was painful was my butt crack <laughs> You're so Tandy and I decided to add in addition to our package that we got we added a full hollywood so an extended so that means it goes all the way to your asshole basically because that's where i used to wax i used to wax till there so it made sense to just you know get that area all cleaned up and she was telling me that that part is actually so much better to do laser as well because when the hair stops growing you stop sweating in that area and you know guys like us uh, like just being female and your intimate bits they just need to be clean and hairless because it just means you are clean ne? longer like you stay fresh all day so yeah if you definitely do it i would definitely say try do the extended because she was like a lot of people are shy and they don't want to like laser their vaginas and their butt crack because it's just like oh everybody everybody is seeing my like my business but guys at the end of the day she she's seen so many different types so she's not judging yours like she's definitely not judging yours so i would leave the details in the description box for you guys that are interested to try it out do dm her and obviously she will create a package for you i think and then let you know how much it is but i am doing like my arms my legs underarms my face so because i demo plane i also chose to do my face so we did like my forehead we did this area this area this area this area so basically my full face so yeah um i guess that's the end of this vlog i am going to clean up a bit because somebody is bringing supper <laughs> No, I had already cleaned a bit in the morning. It's just my room that's a mess. Because <laughs> it's got clothes. 
so now i'm gonna be like running trying to fix everything but yeah um that's the end for this vlog i guess i will see you guys i will actually start vlogging the new one so that it just topples over into tomorrow morning and then tomorrow i'm going to look for my table for upstairs and then we're gonna fix up the patio and then um yeah what did you put the umbrella no i went to look for the cement it's sold out you see when i told you to take it that day which day where you left it because you don't want to carry it no not that one i wanted to actually just buy the one that's round where it's just one because that one is like you have to buy two of them Oh, so I just wanted to buy one. So that one is available, I think, at the builders in Ravonia. So I'll do it tomorrow when I go do my hair. I'll buy it tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm going to buy that tomorrow and then we'll set up the patio. And then maybe we can just then do a braai here on Sunday instead of going to mom's. So that everybody can leave on time and go to their houses. Right? They must come to us, ne? Mm. Yeah, we always go to them. You are. Ne? I said, please, and you are my neighbor. You are. Please. Yeah. yeah, okay, so I think that's the plan to go look for the table so that tomorrow we can on Sunday We can do like a young braai up there and yeah, um, let me start rambling because I've been talking for five minutes I will see you guys in the next video and yeah, thank you so much for all of you that are watching and love you lots Bye